Hi everyone, this is the Legendary R back again with more. This time I'm going to be doing another Bakugan unboxing. This is going to be for the Bakugan Evolutions Rav Battle Pack. Yeah, Rav Platinum 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 Power of Battle Pack. <laughs> the Bakugan Evolutions Power of, Platinum Power of Rav. I don't know what else to say it. I guess it's Platinum Power of Diamond Wrath or I don't know what else to say, but okay. Um, yeah. Sorry for that messed up intro. Wow. Um, anyway, um, well, this is just a pack that has Platinum Wrath in it. That's all you need to know. Then it also comes with um, Nano Clutch. If I'm reading that right. Then Nano Echo, which I don't know what that means, but okay. Um, I'm not on Bakugan Evolutions, I'm still at Geogon Rising, but um, whenever I get here, I know I'll be excited for Wrath, so yeah. Wrath is the main villain's Bakugan, by the way, so keep that in mind. Um, yeah, Nano Clutch and Nano Echo. Echo looks unique, but I'm looking forward to Wrath the most. Anyway, let's get into the unboxing. And now, let's um, let's go over the sheet really quick. So this is the collector's sheet, or the collector's guide, or whatever you want to call it. Feel free to pause if you need anything, because yeah, there's a whole bunch of Bakugan that get that get released like every wave. And yeah, if you um, if you don't know what to look for. And there you go. I know this is during like 2023, so you may never see these in stores because of everything being cycled out. Like how I'm missing a Blitz Fox because of the fact that it got cycled out. But yeah, just um keep that in mind if you're trying to get like all of them. Anyway, let's um right, let's let's start with the gate card. So here's the gate card. That looks. Something. It looks so dark. Wow. This is a card game for children. Anyway, um, <laughs> so the so the gay card has 100 B power for Pyrus, 400 B power for Aquas, 200 B power for Ventus, zero B power for Chaos, 300 B power for Arliss, and 500 B power for Darkus. And it is a flaming fist gay card. So this Nanogon, yeah, Nanogon, is called Clutch, which, okay, I guess it's called Clutch. I guess it's because it looks like a beetle that could clutch something. I don't know. I think that symbol means reroll, but I'm not sure. And then for Flaming Fist, so whenever, then whenever you land on a Green Fist, Helix, or Shield, then you get plus 500 B power. Then here's Echo, which, wow, Echo looks really weird. Looks really dark, too. Darkest Echo, um, wherever you land on one shield, then you get plus 200 B power. Then when you get two shields, you land on six, you get 600 B power, which I don't know how that works because, um, yeah, that's really rare for you to get, like, double... Double cores. Diamond Platinum Wrath. It costs 4 energy to play because it is a diamond evolution. It has 900 B power. It has an evolution. And it has 9 damage. Yeah, it's kind of balanced, but whenever you look at whenever you look at elemental rare sectinoid, you kind of you're kinda of guessing a lot. Anyway, um You have a flaming fist. Well, whenever you land on the flaming fist, I guess it's that, that one symbol that I don't know. But yeah. Then you have the regular wrath, which is platinum wrath. This thing looks cruel. <laughs> like it looks really powerful and just evil. Anyway, it it takes two flaming fists to play, which it does have. And then it has, um, whenever you land on the flaming fist, you get that, that symbol I don't know. It also has 300 B power and 7 damage. So, 
So the two cores, for the first Flame and Fist, there's 250 B power and 3 damage. And for the second Flame and Fist, there is minus 5 damage. For the Nano Gun, I don't know how to open them now, but I could try. Oh, that's interesting. Sounds like a half Bakugan. Then when you open it up. Is that it? Oh. Wow, that's... Wow. I mean, I don't like bugs, but wow. That's, um... This is unique. It's really unique. I don't know what I'll do with the Nanogon. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the Nanogon either, but, um... They're nice to have. So, that one was Clutch, and this one is... This one is Echo. So, yeah. Oh, so it was just stiff. It was stiff because it's new. Yeah, ball joints. Stiff ball joints because it would be new, pretty much. Yeah, you just pull out these sides and then this piece comes out too, I think. And then it looks like this. Which, I don't know how I feel about it, but it looks different. I really like it though, because of the translucent parts. It, it looks, looks really cool when you get the full picture, but when you first look at it, you just wonder, what is this? And I still don't know what it is, but it looks cool. And this thing looking cool is, um, is more important than anything else at the moment. Anyway, um, here's the Bakugan. The Bakugan is Wrath. Wrath is the villain for Bakugan Evolutions. And, yeah. I'm not sure if that's a spoiler or not, but even if it is... Um, I don't think that's really gonna do much, because, yeah. Anyway, um... Here is the symbol for Wrath, which is Chaos. Is a Chaos Bakugan. It's weird to see like a Chaos Bakugan being evil, because Chaos normally think like light and stuff like that. But yeah, I like how it's, I like how it's really hunched over, and and the hunched over kind of look to it makes it give makes it seem like it's really evil, especially with the wings and everything. Anyway, let's um let's put it together. I think there's another way for you to get wrath, and that is if you um that is if you get like the Walmart pack. They could get wrath that way. Yeah, it's actually really, it's really easy to close. Just, yeah, I'll do that again. I'll do that again for the people that need to see it. So this is how you close wrath. You bring down the head first. Like you bring down, you bring down the feet. Bring down the head. Then the head will click into place. Then the tail. Oh no, the, the tail should be last. Sorry. Yeah, you click down the feet, click down the head, and then you bring down... The, the wings will also bring down the arms, so do those two, and then do the tail last. Then the tail should click everything into place. And there you go. That is Wrath. Okay. So, a, so let's see if I could roll up here on my first try. Bakugan Brawl! And no, I don't. These Platinum Bakugan are hard to roll. From what I can tell, they're hard to roll. Oh wow, it popped open great. I like it. I mean, I can't... You know what, I'll um... Let's see if I can compare it to the... To like the Genesis Collection one. Okay, so I actually have the Genesis Collection one. And I want to... I mean, before I end the video, I want to do this really quick. Here's the Genesis Collection Wrath. Yeah, that is so cool. And it went out Arliss, surprisingly enough. Either way, here are both. If you wanted to see, like, the evolution chain for them. If you want to see, like, the evolution line for Wrath, there you go. It looks pretty cool, like both of them do. Especially with, um, this one being Diamond and it looks like, um, 
and it looks really special, just like the Genesis Collection one does. Anyway, yeah, it's all of you since it's with flashing lights. Anyway, like if you want, share if you want, and subscribe to become a legend in the making. See you next time, bye, and we are proven to be legendary. Stay legendary.